Harry and the Haunted House by Mark Schlichting Hi, I'm Harry. Come have an adventure with me and my friends. To have the story read to you, click over here. To play inside the story, click over here. Here is a story in English. One day my dog, Spot, and I were playing ball with my friends, Amy, Earl, and Stinky. <laughs> Earl threw one of his famous curveballs. Uh-oh! Now you've done it, Harry! That house is haunted! Who's going to get my ball? Harry should get it because he hit it too hard. Stinky should have caught it. Earl threw it too hard. This argument is stupid. That house is creepy, said Earl. It has ghosts! <laughs> I heard that a witch used to live there, said Stinky. It's just an old house. Uh-huh. It's, it's an old haunted, haunted house. <sighs> they thought I was afraid to go in, but I knew they were scared, too. If that house is so scary, let's all go get the ball together. The closer we got to the old house, the bigger and spookier it looked. Did you see that? It was just the wind. Did you hear about the last guy that went in that house? They never saw him. Again. Do, do, do you think anyone still lives there? Let's find out. We knocked three times. At the big front door. But nobody answered. Are you sure you want to go inside, Spot? The front door was open a little, so we went in. I volunteered to take the lead. Inside, the house was dark and filled with old furniture. Hello? Anybody here? Nobody answered. Uh, I saw something move. We heard a fluttering sound. It's a ghost! <laughs> hey, you guys! It's just an old curtain blowing in the wind. Nothing to be scared of. <laughs> We tiptoed slowly down a hallway. We had the feeling someone was watching us. Then something grabbed me and I yelled. Yeah! It was only stinky. Don't do that. Sorry.
Wow. This place used to be really nice. Yeah, before everyone turned into ghosts. I hope we find my ball soon so that we can get out of this creepy place. Come on, you guys. Let's keep looking. It must have been a long time since anyone had lived there. There was dust everywhere. Bless you. I don't see the ball in this room, do you? No! Then we heard a scritch, scritch, scratch sound right behind us. What's that noise? gasped Stinky, and we all stood still. It might be a monster with huge long arms. It could be a skeleton shaking its bones. It might be a zombie dragging one foot. Whatever it is, there it goes again. <gasps> it's just Spot. Harry, your dog has fleas. <laughs> we searched in the front room. We searched in the hall. We searched in the kitchen. Where could that ball be? I don't see it here. Do you spot? <coughs> Let's try over there. He turned a corner and saw a hideous monster coming our way. It was fat. And ugly, with six arms and six legs. And it had long spikes on its head. You guys, it's only your reflection in an old mirror. Boy, that was sure a scary monster. <laughs> let's forget the ball. Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's get, get out, out of this place. place. Then we heard something coming slowly down the stairs. We froze in our steps. Earl screamed. Ah! We turned and we saw it. It was Stinky's ball. My dog had found it. Good dog, Spot. Good dog. Hooray for Spot! <coughs> we stood outside and laughed. <laughs> <laughs> We'd been all through that haunted house. And the scariest thing in it was... Ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> remember when we thought that curtain was a ghost? Or remember when we thought we saw that big scary monster? <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't so bad. We were just scaring each other. See? That house was just empty. It wasn't haunted. It didn't scare me at all. Good. Then you can go back for Harry's hat. He lost it somewhere inside. <laughs> Were you scared? I wasn't. Much. Well, see you again soon. Bye. 
to have the story read to you, click over here. To play inside the story, click over here. Are you sure you want to quit? Okay. Bye.